Hey guys, so today I will be showing you how to make a basic shop icon for IMVU. I will be making a tutorial on how to make an animated shop icon uh, in the near future. Once that video is posted, I will put the link for that in the description below. And yeah, with that being said, let's get started. All right, so this is a tank top I made a really long time ago, and I want to make a shop icon for it. So all I need to do in the chat I'm going to zoom out from my avatar a little bit so I can actually get a full body shot. And I'm just going to type in high res no BG. As you can see at the top here. And then I am just going to have my avatar be in the pose that I want her to be in. And then press enter. And once I press enter, it will take a screenshot. And it puts the screenshot directly on my desktop. So, now that we have our screenshot, all I'm going to do is open up GIMP. So now that we are in GIMP, I'm going to go to File new and for the width it's going to be 100 and then for the height it will be 80 and that is the shop icon size now as far as the background goes you can pretty much do anything you can buy um, icons from different creators um, you can find those all in the forms on imvu there are free pre-made templates that you can download and use which i'm just going to use one of those for uh, today for the sake of time or you can make your own. The possibilities are kind of endless, depending on what you want. To put our screenshot in here, I'm just going to go to File, Open as Layers, and then I'm going to select our screenshot and just open it. And now it's in GIMP as a layer. To resize it, I'm going to click on our Scale tool, click on the layer, and I'm going to link the width and height together so that way it scales evenly by clicking on that icon and then I'm clicking on the corner and dragging down to resize it. It's still a little too big so I'll scale it down a little bit more. It's still not quite how I want it. Just a tad more. So there we go. Now the full tank top is being shown in the icon. To add my background to this, I'm also going to go to File, Open as Layers, and then I have this uh, free IMView icon that I got, and I'm just going to click Open, and I will put it behind our image, and then delete the white background. I'll just center this a little bit more, and there we go. Now in GIMP, when you zoom in, it's going to look very pixelated and blurry. That is just the nature of pixels and because we're working with such a small layout, it's going to look blurry and pixelated when you zoom in to edit anything. Um, so if you do want to edit your photo, I highly recommend doing it before you resize it just because it's going to be a lot easier to edit it when it's in full detail rather than the pixelated. So then if I don't want, like for say, I don't want the shoulders or the head or anything like that being shown, all I have to do is delete that, delete the little excess that's hanging over the bottom there, and there it is a little more centered in the icon. So all I would have to do is go up to File and Export. I'm just going to call it Shop Icon, I'm going to put it on my desktop and click export. Then to put it in IMVU, all I have to do is click upload, add image, and open up my image in IMVU. All you have to do is type in the product name, choose the rating, set your profit, add some keywords so people can search it easier, and that's it. You just submit it to shop. So that is the first way to make an icon. Like I said, I'll be making another one of these for um, animated icons. So be on the lookout for that. Uh, I hope this video helped you guys. If you have any questions or are still having trouble with anything, go ahead and leave it in the comments below and I'll try and get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Thanks so much for watching.